Hello and welcome to our Setting Up Label Cloud how-to videos. In this video, you'll learn about how to add users to your Label Cloud account. So far, we've activated your Label Cloud account and now we're ready to start adding users. In this video, you'll learn about the differences between guest users and organizational users, inviting guest users to Label Cloud, and accepting Label Cloud invitations as a guest user. You can invite internal or external users to your Label Cloud. If your company uses an organizational directory like Office 365 or another Microsoft business service, invite your users as a directory administrator and grant NiceLabel access to your directory so your users can access NiceLabel with their existing accounts. If you don't use an organizational directory or if you want to invite external users, you can invite them individually as guest users your guest users can sign in with Google or Microsoft accounts. All users you invite get an invitation email with an invitation link. Today we'll be adding a single user. To invite your users, type your Label Cloud URL to open Control Center. Once you're in Control Center, go to Administration, Users, and click Invite Guest User. Your new user profile opens where you can fill in your user information. Type your new user's email address. The email address is required, but filling in the rest of the form helps keep you organized in Control Center. We'll add a personal message to include in the invitation email. Add a unique name to display in Label Cloud to help find your user faster. Writing descriptions for your users also helps keep you organized. Under Web Applications, you can start sharing labels and solutions immediately with your users. We'll cover web applications in a future video. For now, let's scroll down to Access Roles. Access Roles give you control over user privileges and label cloud security by limiting access to your files and minimizing human-caused printing mistakes. All your users need at least one access role, and if you don't add one, you can't create your new user. Click Add. The access role window opens. Choose which role to give your invited user. Today we'll use our default access roles, but you can also configure your own access roles with custom privileges. You can learn more about custom access roles in a future video. We'll add our new user as an operator, and click Add to confirm. Click Invite to create your user and send a Label Cloud invitation email. On your Control Center user page, you now see your new user listed with the status Not Signed Up. Their status updates when they activate Label Cloud. Now, here's how your new user activates their account. Remember, if your user can't find our invitation email in their main inbox, they should check folders like Social and Promotions. If your users still can't find their invitation email, have them contact your NiceLabel representative or partner for help. Here we have our activation email. Your user can see the personal message you wrote and then click Sign in and activate your account to do just that. Now your user is successfully signed into Control Center. Once they click here to download NiceLabel software and connect it to Label Cloud, they can start printing labels. Back on your administration user page, you can now see your user status listed as active, so you know they're all ready to go. That's it. Thanks for watching. For more tips on setting up your Label Cloud account, check out our other videos and learn how to do more, faster, with less.